Since the war began, the Russian army has almost entirely been in constant retreat. The Russian people had become tired of the government's incompetency and the war effort in general. Calls for an end to the war and the abdication of the Tsar had finally boiled over. On the 8th of March, 1917, the provisional government, led by Alexander Kretsky, forced the Tsar to abdicate his throne. However, the new government did not meet the people's demands of ending the war with Germany and Austria. Germany seized this opportunity and sent Vladimir Lenin into Russia to cause further chaos. Lenin and the Bolsheviks cooed the provisional government during the October Revolution, throwing the nation into civil war. The main figures in the new Bolshevik government were Vladimir Lenin, Leon Trotsky, Nikolai Bukharin, Lev Kamenev, and Joseph Stalin. Their main adversary in the civil war was the White Army. They consisted of a wide variety of political ideologies, including Republicans, Monarchists, Nationalists, and other anti-communist groups. Some of the main leaders of the White Army included Alexander Kolchak, Lavr Kornilov, Peter Rangel, and Anton Denikin. A small portion of the White Army consisted of the Czechoslovak Legion, who were ethnic Czechs and Slovaks who previously fought for Russia in World War I. Most of the White Army was concentrated around the southern and eastern parts of Russia, while the Bolsheviks were concentrated around Moscow and St. Petersburg. Even though the White Army consisted of much of the former high command of the Russian Empire, the Bolsheviks were better organized, and their army was nearly five times larger than the White Army. Due to international fear regarding the rise of communism in Russia, many foreign governments sent supplies and sometimes even soldiers to aid the White Army. A notable example of this was the American Expeditionary Force. This force was a part of America's intervention that aided the White Army during the war. Other countries that sent forces to Russia were Japan, France, Britain, Romania, and Germany. The war ended on the 16th of June, 1923, after the White Army was defeated by the Bolsheviks. The Bolshevik victory cemented the new communist system in Russia, and the former imperial lands were renamed to the Union of Soviet Socialist Republics. Several countries, such as Finland, Poland, Estonia, Latvia, and Lithuania, were able to gain independence during the chaos of the Civil War, but the rest of the former imperial lands were completely subjugated by the new communist government. The Civil War led to numerous famines across Russia, and approximately between 1 and 2 million refugees fled from Russia. The Bolshevik victory in the war paved the way for Stalin to eventually take power in the Soviet Union.